best intent approach means that you assume the best before reacting and responding to the worst case scenario. So instead of me going in, assuming that the guys are gonna laugh at me, assuming they think I have a stupid question, assuming that they don't want me there to begin with, I assume that most people in this world don't want an awkward conversation. I assume that I can do my job really, really well and that they're doing their job really, really well. And I'm not going to jump to the worst case scenario because once you do that and you get into a habit of reacting and having that conversation in your head about how you're gonna handle this when it all goes sideways and now you have to storm out of the clubhouse and make a big scene. Nobody said that moment? Okay. <laughs> right? Once you start going down that road, you will change every conversation that follows. And now you're not really addressing the issue and you're not really talking to the person. This happens a lot, particularly when you are being asked to collaborate across different groups and different divisions. And going back to the example from operations and sales yesterday, getting an email that says something like, I need more information. That's pretty straightforward. And yet if you catch me on the wrong day, you know what I'm thinking? Do they not know how much work I have to do? Like, how hard is this? I have given them the information they need. Why don't they believe me? Why don't they trust me? And meanwhile, operations on the other side is saying, I don't understand why this is so hard. How come they can't just give me the information? And we start to get out of whack because what we don't see is that everybody is doing the very best they can 99% of the time. The minute you start looking at the positive, instead of preparing for the worst case scenario, now you are going to have a more productive conversation. You're gonna eliminate a lot of conversation inefficiencies because you're actually going to hear what is happening. This is one of the most challenging things to master, but once you do, it changes the way that you relate to people. And it changes the way that you hear other messages. Like, can you stop by my office for a few minutes when you get